Also coming up on Good Day Saturday, a six-year-old author in our midst. Laurie's going to sit down to talk about where her book idea came from and how she got it onto store shelves. We have some very special guests this morning. Joining me are Sammy and Karen Fitzgerald. And Sam is the author of this new book. It's Fish Sticks, Books, and Blue Jeans. And more remarkably, well, she's seven years old. And uh, what we want to find out from you is, I mean, most um, seven-year-olds are, you know, playing Pokemon or something like that. What encouraged you to write this book? Why did you want to do it? The reason I wanted a book just like my mom and dad had. Okay. And what was their book about? Their book was about teaching with um, lots of hard things for children. Okay. I and mean, it wasn't for children. So we tried to look for a book for children like that, but they didn't have one. And so you thought what? So I went up to my mom and said, it's okay, we'll just make a book instead of buying a book. Well, I have to imagine this isn't the first time that she's done something on her own like that. No, she's a pretty precocious child, and the books that we were dealing with were teaching gratitude and being thankful, and Sammy wanted to use our workbooks, but they were geared for adults and not children, so uh, basically we said, okay, well, well, we'll find something, figuring we'll go to the store. And between the stores and the Internet, we figured we'd find something. Right. And so I was looking through it, and I see these things that maybe you just wouldn't stop to think about, um, being thankful for um, people who love you. And the workbook has you write down people who love you in your life and to draw a picture of it. How do you think that helps kids? It helps kids by you. The kids can learn that your grandparents and your mom and your dad and everybody in your family love you very much and they can draw a picture of how they love you right and i imagine i mean one of the um, one of the things that i saw um, that really kind of hit home with me with two little kids at home you know getting kids to stop and think about this might help curb those temper tantrums about materialistic things absolutely and that's one of the things that i mean sammy's seven so she still has the traits of a normal seven-year-old but it is some of the things um, you know we don't find a lot of the buy me get me going on which is nice and it's rubbed off on a lot of her friends and um, she's making a lot of new friends that have the same thought process so which, which it's is great neat. it teaches yeah. them not to be so selfish yeah. what's it been like going around and talking about your book i mean you're on tv this morning that's not something that a seven-year-old <laughs> typically does <laughs> Um, it's changed really because I've been on the radio, I've been on in the newspaper, I've been on phone calls, I've been everywhere. Well, you're getting the word out and we appreciate you getting up early to come and talk to us this morning. <laughs> Hopefully some folks will want to go online and get your book. And there is a link to Sammy's website on our website. It's myfoxdfw.com. You can find out more information on how you can order her book and you can see some of her other work. She's seven and she has other work. <laughs> Thank you all for being here with us this morning. Thank you. Allow